Hi there. So here's my bike. Um, I've been challenged by a friend to make cycling safer. And over the past two nights, uh, here's what I've come up with so far. Okay, so uh, you can see here, there's a Arduino board connected with some wires and hooked up to some LEDs and a push button on the handle. And it's powered by a powered by USB by a power bank. Okay, and here's how it works. Okay, so let's say you're on the turn right, you press the button. And the LED at the back and at the front will light up on the right side and let's say if you want to turn left press the left button and the left side will blink okay and then there's also a speaker right at the breadboard to give you your audio feedback just like in a car okay and the timer will oh sorry the the signal the turn signal will auto timer after 20 blinks or when the user presses any button so let's see I'm gonna turn right Okay, it blinks. If I press it again. It'll stop blinking. Okay, let's do it again. So cancel signal. And turn right. And I can cancel the signal with a left button. So left cancel signal. Left and Cancel signal with the right. Okay. So and apart from turning, giving the left and right turn signal, I've added one more feature, which is uh, the hazard light feature, which is a uh, normally you just press press it press the turns the push button once, and you'll be turning. Press another time to cancel the signal. Okay, and to activate the hazard light, what you do is you press and hold the right side and all the LEDs will blink just like in a hazard light signal. Okay, and to cancel the hazard light signal, you just press any of the button. Okay, so try it again. Okay, cancel. Okay, turning right. Cancel. Right. Cancel. Okay, so let's have a closer look at the circuitry. It's powered by an Arduino Uno board, uh, connected to a breadboard, with a speaker right in the middle. And the board is powered by a power bank, and attached to it, is a power meter. Okay, so you can see it's only at five volts, drawing fifty milliampers of power. So let's see. 
see. Okay, so 50 milliamps of power during standby. So let's see when the signal is activated, how much power it draws. Comes. 140 milliamps. Okay, and let's activate the hazard light. Still a bit glitchy. 